Hi guys, today in this video we're going to be opening up a bundle box from Amonkhet, the newest set in the Magic the Gathering card game. And yeah, there's 10, 10 boosters in this box, and on the back it'll show you what it comes with. There's a player's guide, there's a card box, there's 10 booster packs, 25 double-sided tokens in these boxes. There's 80 basic land pack, including 20 full art basic lands. Then you got your your spin down life counter and just a quick reference card. So let's open it up and see what we get. Of course. This is that little box that you get. You get your book. It's got all the cards in it from that set. And you get like a checklist on the back for the invocations. There's that many of them. Then the sleeve that goes around the box has a art design on it. Open it up and show you right quick. It's just the design that's on the, the box itself. Alright, let's open this box up and see what we get for packs. We got our, our dice. It's the same as what comes in the pre-release boxes. I think it's the only one that they have for this set. These are our tokens. In the land pack, I'm assuming the full arts are probably along the back. But that's the land pack one I might actually open. I have about 40 of them. And then our 10 booster packs. Alright. We'll start opening them up, see what we get inside. Okay, first pack. We have Rhett Crop Spearmaster. Hieroglyphic Illumination. Fling, that's a reprint. Ornery Kudu. Doom Die Center. Those Who Serve. Scribe of the Mindful. Supernatural Stamina. Stinging Shot. Magma Spray. And our first uncommon. We have Onward and Victory. We have Defiant Great Maw. Cast out. And for our rare, we have a Gideon right off the bat. That's a $50 card right there. That's a very nice pull. Good way to start off a box. Nothing like that. Alright, pack number two. <clears throat> we have... Brute Strength, Sacred Cat, Cancel, Colossipede, Doom Dis Die Center, Scribe of the Mindful, Bitter Blade Warrior, Hone Kopesh, Death Crop Entangler, Katrush of Ambi Ambition, our first uncommon, we have a Kefnet's Monument. Wayward Servant, Baleful Emmet, and for our rare for this pack, we have Never and Return. Our third pack. Okay, we have Spiring Mummy, Hecma Sentinels, Manticore of the Gauntlet. Pitiless Vizier, Gift of Paradise, Wasteland Scorpion, Emberhorn Minotaur, Those Who Serve, Scribe of the Mindful, 
in our first uncommon, we have Ruthless Sniper. Then we have Bontu's Monument. And Crop Champion. And for the rare for this pack, Glory Bound Initiate. And we have a foil. We have a Vizier of Remedies. Now for pack number four. First card in this pack, we have Minotaur Sure Shot. Then we have Dejiru's Resolve, Hackma Sentinels, Nimble Blade Kenra, Pitiless Vizier, Spidery Grasp, Blighted Bat, Haze of Pollen, Impeccable Timing. Hyena Pack, and our first uncommon, we have Ruthless Sniper, Lay Claim, a Grasping Dunes, and for the rare for this pack, Approach of the Second Sun, and we have a Full Art Swamp. Now pack number five. We have Supply Caravan, uh, <clears throat> Illusory Wrappings, Illusory Wrappings, Manticore of the Gauntlet, Wing Shepherd, Cursed Minotaur, Benefaction of Ronus, of Ronus, Compulsory Rest, Winds of Rebuke. Final Reward, Die Center's Deliverance, and our first uncommon for this pack, which is a good card for Red Aggro, Flame Blade Adept, and our second uncommon is Trial of Zeal, and we have Decimator Beetle, and the rare for the pack, we have Pull from Tomorrow, and another Full Art. Halfway through the box, move them over. Now for the second half, pack number six. We have Spiring Mummy, Naga Oracle, Tormenting Voice, Supply Caravan, Soul Stinger, Colossopy. Die Center's Deliverance, Cartruce of Strength, Hyena Pack, Impeccable Timing, and our first uncommon, Nest of Scarabs, Renewed Faith, Grave Digger, and for the rare for this pack, we have Hapatra the Vizier of Poison, and another full art. Always like getting full arts. Okay, pack number seven. We have Naga Oracle. Tormenting Voice again. Supply Caravan. Illusory Wrappings. Quarry Hauler. Scarab Feast. Catrus of Strength. Hyena Pack. Impeccable Timing. Uh, Luxa River Shrine. And the first uncommon for this pack, we have Labyrinth Guardian, Cast Out, Vizier of Tumbling Sands, and the rare for this pack, we have Insult to Injury. Okay, pack number eight. Okay, we have... Forsake the Worldly, Compelling Argument, uh, Thresher Lizard, Ret Crop Spearmaster, Soul Stinger, Giant Spider, Splendid Agony, Hyena Pack, 
Hooded Brawler, Luxor River Shrine. First on Colin, we have Zenith Seeker. Then we have Synchronized Strike, Scale Behemoth, and for the rare for this pack, we have Cruel Reality. Pack number nine. We have Compelling Argument, Brute Strength, Cartouche of Solidarity, The Truth of Knowledge, Benefaction of Ronus, Pitiless Vizier, Looks a River Shrine, Hooded Brawler, River Serpent, Unwavering Initiate, Consuming fever, or fervor. That was our first uncommon. Our second one is Devoted Crop Mate. And we have Uncrop Champion. Now the rare for this pack, we have Sweltering Sun. It's basically the new Anger of the Gods, just with a cycling ability on it. And the last pack, we have Mighty Leap, Ancient Crab, Desert Ceridon, Forsake the Worldly, Soul Stinger, Pouncing Cheetah, Winds of Rebuke, or Rebuke, Final Reward, Dice Center's Deliverance, Cartouche of Strength. Our first uncommon. Alright, sorry about that guys. I ran out of space on my SD card. So, let's continue from where we left off. Our second uncommon for that last pack was Watchful Naga. Then we have Uncrop Crasher. And the rare for this pack, we have Heaven and Earth. Alright, well, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me open these packs. The very first pack was a surprise for me. I've been in kind of a, a rare drought type thing. It ain't been getting anything good. But I'd say we did have decent with this box. But yeah. Well, thanks for watching. You can hit like, share, subscribe. And if you like, you can leave a comment down in the comments. And I'll make sure I get back to everybody that tries to leave a comment. And if you like, you can check me out on Twitter. You can check me out on Google+. Plus. I usually share all my videos on there as well. And like always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later.